Greetings everyone, this is Curtis Duncan, aka Dr. C, checking in with you. And I'm going to be doing some more videos because I always have a lot to say and I realize that it might be more effective to just make videos and then I can share them with that whenever. Because uh, I, I put a lot of stuff on Facebook all, a lot um, and you know, I realize that that may not be the most effective way to communicate. So nonetheless, getting right into the topic uh, so you know you know just be on the lookout if you see like three videos from me in one day then you know what's up I'm just making videos to put the information out there so you can be empowered to make healthier choices today we're gonna talk about vitamin water and how it is worse than soda that's right I'm saying it vitamin water is worse than soda absolutely why well you know first of all vitamin water contains crystalline fructose Crystalline fructose is something that is 99% fructose. Now, regular soda contains high fructose corn syrup. High fructose corn syrup is about 55 to 40% fructose. Now, uh, crystalline fructose, which is actually made also from corn too, GMO corn at that, uh, contains 99% fructose. And if you know anything about what I've been putting out lately, fructose is the most dangerous sweetener out there. It causes insulin resistance inflated cholesterol levels, inflated triglyceride levels, type 2 diabetes, which is the same thing as insulin resistance, uh, and also increased, increased levels of uric acid, which has been shown to uh, cause heart disease and high blood pressure. Uh, fructose is, is totally uh, harmful for the body. And when I talk about fructose, I'm not talking about uh, fruit. Fruit is separate from fructose. Fructose is a simple carbohydrate. It can be found in a variety of different foods at various concentrations. The concentrations which is found in fruit are usually very low. And sometimes the fruits may or may not contain fructose. It might contain sucrose, it might contain glucose, it might contain a variety of different carbohydrates, I mean, but the levels that they're at are usually way lower. But when we're dealing with the isolated sweetener like crystalline fructose, which is a you know, this new fat sweetener on the scene now, which is really, really toxic then you are dealing with something that the liver cannot handle because the liver metabolizes fructose. Glucose gets metabolized uh, via the hormonal system, uh, the insulin secretions, and you know the it, it gets uh, you know directly put into your muscle tissue. But fructose gets metabolized by the liver, and that's why people consume a lot of fructose. Oftentimes, develop a uh, worse liver consequences or disease uh, more so than diabetics. So when people consume uh, any type of fructose based sweetener, be it agave, crystalline fructose, they are greatly uh, jeopardizing their health. And that's what vitamin water contains. You read the ingredients, what does it say? It says uh, deionized water, crystalline fructose. That's the second ingredient. And it's very deceptive what they do with vitamin water because it only says 50 calories. But there's about 2.5 ounces in you know, per serving size, which basically means that, okay, if they put 50 calories and there's like three service, and there's three or four serving sizes, which it says on the back of the bottle, then that really means every time you have a bottle of vitamin water, you're really consuming about, you know, about 200 calories uh, per bottle. And I'm sure the average person is, might might be drinking uh, one or two bottles, one or two bottles per day. And if you are doing this, you are greatly jeopardizing your health because, as I mentioned, the, the higher the fructose concentration, the more damaging the sweetener can be. So high fructose corn syrup only contains 55%, but crystalline fructose is 99.9% .9 fructose. And as I said, this has been shown to be uh, the, the primary causation of insulin resistance and, uh, and elevated cholesterol levels even more so than other traditional foods that we might think that cause these diseases like white sugar, uh, eggs, butter, and whatnot. So uh, just know that vitamin water is a complete fraud. Uh, the vitamins in there, are, most of them are, in, are inabsorbable. They can't be absorbed. Uh, then they're in an inorganic format um, and they're synthetic so the body cannot absorb them. And as I mentioned, it's, it's pure sugar. It's pure sugar and it's being sold. This is what's so dangerous about it. It's being sold as a healthy drink. So uh, the, 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 comp the, the, the manufacturers of vitamin water have duped the American populace into believing that this beverage you know, is healthy when it's not, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's actually worse for you than soda due to the fact uh, of the sweetener that they use in it, which also has been found to contain lead. Uh, it's also been found to contain uh, arsenic. 
uh, lead and arsenic, which are very uh, dangerous heavy metals. This is what uh, crystalline fructose contains. And as I mentioned earlier, it's actually made from corn. You know, what they do is that, is that they crystallize the high fructose corn syrup in order to create this really, really high, high fructose sweetener. So uh, it contains all the problems that we would be associated with uh, consuming uh, GMO foods, which are also subsidized by the government. So that's why crystalline fructose is so cheap because you know it's also being subsidized by the government. Your taxpayer dollars are subsidizing this this crap of uh, vitamin water that's being sold. So just beware, ladies and gentlemen, that you know if you're trying to uh, find a, a healthier a liquid beverage, uh, vitamin water is not going to be a good alternative. It actually uh, might be worse for you. And particularly um, due to the fact that it's being promoted as something that's healthy. A lot of people know about the dangers of sodas these days. They've seen the studies about, uh, you know, about how, st how sodas makes children fat and uh, whatnot. Uh, but the reason why the, the soda is making children fat is because of the simple fact that, you know, children are consuming a lot of the soda and due to the fact that it contains high fructose corn syrup. Uh, so when you're dealing with something that uh, contains uh, you know, any type of high fructose sweetener or something that's really, really high like crystal crystalline fructose, uh, you are greatly increasing your chance, chances of being overweight and developing type 2 diabetes. Uh, so you know, if we're going to look at uh, all these different diseases, we have to look at our consumption of some of these, uh, some of these sweeteners and some of these liquid beverages, which are usually uh, grotesquely uh, overmarketed and overhyped and very very unhealthy. So you can get some more information uh, to your to your in the box above about the dangers of fructose and obesity and uh, cholesterol and whatnot. Uh, but just know that uh, vitamin water is going to be um, you know worse than soda and it's more likely to make you uh, a diabetic and fat uh, than soda is. So. Thank you, everyone. Uh, feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions. Uh, I'm always available to do consultations one-on-one -on -one to answer your weight loss or health questions. Uh, and please share this video with others uh, because, you know, this information is really important. Uh, you know, these sweeteners are really killing us, uh, you know, and they're killing us uh, sweetly or you could say softly maybe. Uh, but share this video with others. I know vitamin water is really popular these days, and I expect it to continue to be popular as people start to maybe, you know, get out of soda. I mean, but the only problem is, is that they're going to a more deadly alternative when they're dealing with vitamin water. So thank you again. Have a wonderful day, y'all. Peace.